Hi guys, Kendia here with Simply Kendia. I'm back to share a, a custom journal with you. This is a um, journal that I uh, made for a lovely lady who wants, and her husband who wants to document the, their child's life as she grows up. So they wanted a lot of writing space in here. So that's what I gave them. So on the front, um, we have her name, Elena, and this cute little pocket that they can stuff stuff in. The butterfly and the chicken and flowers and this pretty lace and this applique of flowers. So she wanted flowers and chickens and butterflies in here. So that's what we did. On the spine, I did this beautiful crocheted piece with this pretty pink and white check um, fabric on the background. So that's the flowers, just like the rest of the theme. I thought it went really well. I did book corners on all four of the corners to help keep it make it a little sturdier and for this one um, instead of a cereal box I used an old shoe box so it's a little bit heavier duty than um, the ones that are usually made out of recycled cardboard so this is a thicker recycled cardboard I found this beautiful paper line that was the pinks and pale blues and some purplish um, colors because she wanted all like lots of pink and some pale pastel -y colors so I did a little bit of washi tape decorating. Um, it might be hard to, for the camera to pick it up, but I did do some faint um, pink lemonade dyeing on these pages, and a little bit of the it picked a little bit of the coffee up from my dyeing surface. So um, there's a little hints of brown and and pink on these pages, and I think it turned out real pretty. She wanted the pages to be nice and pale so that. It would be easy to write on so um, just a little bit of pale pink in there is what I was going for Le um, graph paper and line paper some old ledger paper some old line paper uh, receipt and then she also wanted some yellow in here as well I thought to add that because the chickens are yellow so I wanted to coordinate all the colors in as well and then I added these cute little tags that she can journal a little thing on the back of. Then I had these um, little cute little things, uh, journaling envelope cards things. I'm not sure what to call them. <laughs> Let's call them things um, that were for, for a baby book. And so I thought I'd add them in here so they can add special moments, little moments in those. So, some really pretty flower stickers, and I did these little tuck spots, and two of them accidentally got glued in the wrong direction, so they open up so you can draw, and so the two that op got glued with the opening facing out, I added a couple little tags in there. And then, you know, no wasted journaling space because we got all the extra space inside. And this is light enough that you can journal on as well. And then all the cutoffs I left in here so she can use them for writing in or use them to cut out hearts or, or flowers or what have you to make more decorations in the book if she wants more decorations. I decorated it very lightly because they said they wanted lots of writing space. But if she wants a little bit more, I can add a little bit more before it gets sent. Or she can um, do a little bit herself as well if she is so inclined. So lots of paper, as you can see. Um, some washi tape there. So there's five signature. That was our first signature. I did add a little bit of lace. This is a pretty flower pattern on it with this beautiful yellow flower. So we'll flip through quickly because it's all pretty much the same. Slightly different pattern papers. This one with the pretty yellow flowers. Um, here's another one of those cards that says I laughed when you and you can write some little thing about what made you laugh about your cute little daughter. Don't you just love this paper? It's just so beautiful. Another tuck there and a flip out. This one flips over too. And it's the other one that got glued on this side, so I added those little tags there. I added a little paraphernalia into there, a little 
things that you're saving for your daughter, you know, little tickets or what have you. Another little chicken there. This is from some antique fabric that has these cute little chickens on it that I added to here. Another washi tape. And then I have this pretty pearl um, organza ribbon. So I added that on. Another card and another one of the thingies. <laughs> That's what we're just going to call them, is thingies. And then I have this antique book that is about baby animals. And I added the mother hen and her baby chicks in here. We thought it was just so beautiful and went with the, the adding the little chickens. And I have my card and some pretty butterfly paper and those two of those envelope things. Journaling. Envelope journaling cards, that old column. There we go. <laughs> I have a, my brain doesn't work very well, so I have a hard time with, and I always just call stuff things because that's what my brain can think of. This pretty butterfly that says life is good. Some more of the journaling envelope cards. Another little chicken, some more of the offcuts, a pretty flower, another clip up, and the last signature, more of the same papers, all paley, pastel y colored papers. I think it turned out real cute, and I hope that they enjoy it. Had some butterflies and flowers in here and like a few little chickens. So and that is the end of this book. So um I hope it's enjoyed and loved. That's what I create my books for is to be enjoyed and loved. And uh I will see you guys next time when I have a book to share with you. Bye.